Well, the Hillsborough County Commission took a step today to limit the access children have to certain books in the public library. The commission also voted to end its affiliation with the American Library Association because they say the group has gone radical and is being led by an admitted Marxist. Jeff Patterson joins us live in Tampa to explain. Jeff. Good evening, Stacey and Josh. Well, Hillsborough County Commissioner Michael Owen says this isn't about banning books. It's about giving parents the tools they need to protect their children. But some parents and one minister disagree, saying if this goes through, even the Bible may be removed from the shelves of public libraries. It's an issue sweeping across the country, limiting access for children to certain books that some people find to be obscene. Commissioners, this isn't about uh, banning books. This is about protecting our youth and working with parents. Commissioner Michael Owen made a motion today to have the county investigate ways to prevent children under the age of 18 from having access to books intended for mature audiences. I am the proud parent of a child in the trans community. So I'm used to people saying that they are banning things in order to protect my child. But several parents at the meeting objected, saying they should be the ones to decide what their children can and cannot read. It is not the job of the library to take out any book that might scare my daughter. It is my job. Nicole Huff says she allows her child into the adult section for a somewhat surprising reason. We go together and we look at books. We look at books in the juvenile section and the children's section. We also look at books that are in sort of the adult section because the Marvel comic books are in the adult section. Motion carried. But Owen's motion passed, asking the county library board to recommend a policy to allow parents to opt out of adult content online and to limit what books children can borrow. Empower parents. That's exactly what we need to do. Several public speakers read passages today from the Bible that they pointed out contain excerpts of sex, sometimes rape, sometimes incest, and they say because of that, the Bible could be removed from the public shelves of libraries. We'll have more on that coming up at 5.30. Live in Tampa, Jeff Patterson, 8 on your side.